Kiki, I have, Kiki, I have learned that Indonesia is with their hands. I want to use my head when eating too, but my parents don't like it when I use my head. Yes, because you need to constantly wash your hands and keep your hands clean to eat you with your hands. Lesson from the student from Indonesia to share how they found that their food candy salt on healthy food and some of students didn't wash head before eating and how they try to make everyone become healthier and care more about personal hygiene. Let's welcome Rima Dita, Haria Dita, Risa and Sasabila to share their story. Before we start our presentation, we have something for you. I'm Salsa Mila. We are from Indonesia. We have two more friends, Arifia and Asi, who unfortunately cannot join us here. 
We choose healthy and nutritious food in our school as our topic. We choose this topic because many of our friends are addicted to soda drinks, instant noodles, and other unhealthy snacks. To make things worse, our school canteen also sold this kind of food. We are bothered because we know this kind of food are unhealthy, yet our friends still like to consume them. Our project impacted the whole school, all students, teachers, and employees. Many people support our project, but still there are people who don't support us because they feel they get no benefit from it. For me, the most memorable experience was when we learned to cook. We, was when we learned to cook. We put too little water when cooking rice, so it was cooked properly. For me, it was when we plant vegetables and fruits. I'm the only boy in the team, so I did most of the physical work. <laughs> For me, when we gave campaign about healthy and nutritious food, we did a short drama in front of our juniors. I thought it was very interesting. We faced some difficulties as well. We had problems when coordinating among ourselves, like when delegating tests, and it was hard to communicate our idea with the school. We also faced some difficulties when convincing our friends to support our project because they were skeptical about it. But we also had some funny experiences, like when surveying the lunchbox program, some students had the lunchbox from us instead of showing it. I've got one too. When we evaluate the solution based on QBL principle, we are Q a lot. And in the end, give the decision to Ramanita. Through this project, we learn a lot of things. I learn to be more self-confident. I learn better communication skill. I learn to be more patient and mindful. Actually, I was one student addicted to soda drinks, so now I'm cutting my soda consumption. For our next step, we want to do a couple of things. First, we want to improve our solution so they are more long-lasting and can reach more people. We would like to do campaign about healthy and nutritious food in other schools as well. We hope everyone eats healthy and nutritious food and stay healthy. Thank, Thank you. you! Terima kasih! Thank you for sharing your story with us. Now we need to walk here. Everyone, when I count to three, please say Yuan Wu Cheng Gong. One, two, three. Yuan Wu Cheng Gong. 